This is Jennifer Aline Graham, the blogger for the Speaking Out About Self-Injury blog on HealthyPlace.com. Today this vlog is mostly about expressing who you are and not being afraid of it. You know, you hear about this topic in health classes and any kind of class at school and counseling, you know, if your parents are like mine and give off positive energy, they talk about it all the time. And it's up to you to be the one to follow in that advice. You know, be comfortable with who you are. Maybe you are, have a weirdly loud laugh. Maybe you have funky style. You like to wear big glasses or weird hats or, you know, weird pants. And maybe some people bully you for it. Don't listen to them. For one minute, Ignore the judgments. You know, maybe you like to collect weird things. I collect typewriters. Maybe you're embarrassed about something. And it's really hard to push the judgments away and the bullying away and focus on you. When I was a self-harmer, I didn't know self-harming or cutting or burning was an issue. I really didn't. And after some time in observing people's arms and bracelets and realizing there were other people, I decided to get help. I decided not to be afraid of getting that help. And I learned to be myself. I came out of my skin. I started, you know, not hiding my crazy personality. And I wrote. And that was my coping skill. Find what makes you comfortable in your own skin. And don't be afraid of those around you who may judge you for it. Right now, today, I dare you to go up to somebody in your school, go up to somebody, you know, maybe in the mall that you don't know, and say something great about them. Yeah, you'll be afraid. I'd be afraid. Do it. You will feel so great after you do it. Maybe there's some quiet kid in the back of your class who, you know, doodles the entire class and is very, you know, antisocial, go up to that person and say, hey, how's your day? Or what are you drawing back here? You know, I've always wondered. Go up to somebody who you've never talked to before and say, your hair is just beautiful. Or, you know, hey, I saw you, you know, in phys ed, playing this. You're really great, guy. Are you going to try out for this team? You know, go up to somebody and make their day. You know, no matter what, you'll feel great. You want everybody to feel comfortable, and you don't want people to feel as if they're being judged. When I wore bracelets up to here, I felt like that's what everybody was staring at. You know, be yourself. Have them hear you and see you as somebody different and not some struggle that you're going through. Be yourself. And don't be afraid of it. And that takes a while to get to that point. And you can do it. Thank you so much for listening to this video blog. You can read some more of my blogs on HealthyPlace.com under the Speaking Out About Self-Injury blog. Also, my novel Noon is available on Amazon.com, Nook, and Kindle. Thank you guys so much and be yourself.